Here we are on Cleveland Pier today. Got some company with me for a change. Lovely view. Very nice. Well, yeah, so on Cleveland Pier. So this pier originally uh, was, well, was lost in a storm in the 70s, I believe. And the end, uh, well, for want of a better word, came off. And uh, they repaired it in the 80s, they had to raise a big fund to do it. Uh, and in the end, they managed to uh, reconnect the pier, and ever since then, it's been run by a local charity and volunteers. So yeah, it was quite interesting. Just walking down the pier now. Over there, you can see Cardiff in Wales. Always a joy. A lovely day around Cleveland, lovely part of the world, really couple of swimmers which is nice oh yeah what about 1866 the original Hamilton Swin Swinsaw Ironworks so we'll see what the original parts there an array of foliage and along here when you pass on wherever we go or if we go anywhere you can pay to have your name in a plaque so that'd be something interesting to do and also the plaques are all along here as well well small plaques but yeah it's quite gappy this uh wood oh. see so straight through the gaps there But we had a, a lovely uh, flapjack. What was that place called? Call that, that cafe? Uh, bar something. So bar something, which is over there. Very nice. Uh, if you ever come to Cleveland, yeah. We was a lovely uh, sausage bat, flapjack, and a nice chai latte to start off the day. Which we do have to pay to get on the pier. Uh, it's free, free fifty with the uh, gift aid. But it's well worth it. It's a, it's a beautiful pier, especially on a sunny day like this. It's definitely worth the old uh, the fee. And it does look stunning. I mean, over there, Steep Palm Island. Uh, see, we'll be there's nice clear over there, just behind there. Oh, there's west to see from there. So that's the old swimming area where they swim regularly. There's a couple of nutters out there swimming this morning. So yeah, lovely. So yeah, I'm not sure the uh, where the pier was built. I'll put some information in the video originally, but it. Yeah, it definitely was drawn in the 70s um, when, when the uh, storm occurred. That the air was broken off. And I don't know, but it was the 80s that they finally got it back together after a lot of fun that was derelict for quite a few years. As you can see, that's the end of the pier now, so that would have been the original bit. I think, <coughs> I think the end of it over there is still the original. Uh, actual building. I think it, it, I think they used to get the boat out when it was uh, hanging off the end, and they repaired it regularly. They kept the maintenance up on that side. They managed to get up and do it. Um, the, the original Victorian tea rooms. So yeah. What in? And the volunteers. They obviously do a bit of fishing. Again, we're on the uh, <coughs> original iron cast, though, I guess, in 1863. So, yeah, it's Cleveland Pier, really interesting. Uh, 
Very interesting indeed, especially on a sunny day like this. You can see there's a few hotels up there. I mean, the cost of living up there won't be cheap. And there's the original Victorian tea room. That I said previously, they still the original for when the pier was officially built. I'll get some information, information and put it on the bottom of the video. So yeah, that's Clevedon Pier. Well worth a visit. Get a little bit of video part of the video of the actual tea room itself but yeah lovely you get your coffee and your victoria sponge which is nice takeaway coffee served here lovely i just need to do a little bit of the history actually well, there we are, look. The total, call, total cost of the pier head restoration was two million. And that's when it first opened. Uh, oh yeah, 16th of October 1970, so actually earlier than I thought they redid it. Very interested. Oh, information on there. So it is grade listed in 2003. Oh. Yes, yeah, so it actually was 1988, sorry, that it reopened. My mistake. So the Balmoral ship would have gone down to the old pier in Western, which is another debacle. So that's currently derelict and the only pier in Britain built on an island. Yeah, go back to rebuilding there. More history. Very interesting. There we go, that's the end of view. Please do not climb on me. And now for the fisherman. So uh, I hope you all enjoy the little five minutes of Clevedon Pier, try and get some more historical sites in soon. But yeah, what a lovely day and what a lovely pier. It's definitely worth a visit. See you later.